here with the star of Jack Ryan, John Krasinski. Everybody knows and loves you as an actor, but of course now you're a big time director. Am I a big time director? You are a big time oh, director. Thank you very Quiet much. Quiet Place, Quiet Place Two, two Quiet Place Three. three. Um, uh, you were in the, on The Office. That was sort of you know a semi documentary style. Did that influence your directing in any way? Oh, The Office was my film school. I mean, I was a waiter. That's what I was. I was just a professional waiter. Got the office. Actually went back to waiting tables. <laughs> After the pilot, I went, this show's not going anywhere. So <laughs> I went back to waiting tables. And so we were, it felt like I was in a repertory company of actors because nobody was really watching us in the beginning. And so I got to, in all my free time, go up to the writer's room and see what it really is to foster an idea. And every joke that was told, you could almost see it in the air. And they were like, this could work and this could work and this is great. And they were all working together. And then the editors brought me down and said, this is what the first cut looked like, the second cut. All the camera guys showed me how to use the camera. So I was in full film school at the office. I definitely would not be directing if it wasn't that for that show. Wow. Yeah. Wow. It's true. True story. It's true story. Mm -hmm. Put a little spice in it. Um, obvious follow-up, what kind of restaurant? Many. I got fired from nine. Did you really get fired? Yeah. It's hard to get fired from a restaurant, man. Well... Were you putting your thumb in the chowder? Not my thumb. Um, <laughs> no. No. As I said... <laughs> are, are your kids going to watch this? Are we still this? editing? Can yes. we edit that out? There we you can't. Go. That's going uh -huh. live. Did okay, you really perfect. get fired that many times? I did. I remember um, I was going to an audition, and some guy said, if you walk out that door to go to an audition, don't even come back. And I turned around, and I went, OK. <laughs> and I walked out and went to an audition wow. that I didn't get. Oh, well. Yeah. Um, oh, that was sad. I should tell a different story. <laughs> and then I got the office. And then you got Jack Ryan. That's right. That's right. I want to. I, I'm a big fan of your Jack Ryan. Thank you very I, much. I, you know, you've always been a nice fan of the show. I've re I've, I've, I, I've I enjoyed loved it the bit the very, we did. Yeah. I, I don't remember. Oh, we fought. We um, fought. You don't remember the bit we did? I remember wow. kicking your ass. That's all I remember. Oh, I, remember I threw the... you off a roof. Um, and I'm okay. <laughs> now who seems more intimidating? So, uh, I've loved season one, loved season two. When's season three available? Uh, December 21st for Christmas. Oh, yeah. Wow. The holidays, The yeah. solstice. The solstice. There you go. What do, we, uh, what, do we, what do we learn from Jack this time? Who are we fighting? This time, Jack's on the lam. He's out on his own. He's gone rogue. Is that so... how the second season ended? <laughs> that Is was that the how... best. Can we just capture that? Ooh. Sure. That, that was amazing. Be a, great, a great, you know, yeah. cell phone ring. Yeah, it really would. Yeah. Yeah, so he's, uh, the CIA is after Jack this season, and you don't know why. Mm -hmm. Is Wendell Pierce still in it? Wendell Pierce is very Fant much in it. The Fant best. Fantastic. Michael Kelly is yep. amazing. Mm -hmm. And did you have to get, did you have to get, uh, you know, Jack Ryan? I don't know, you tell me. <laughs> that was... No? No. How long yeah, that was embarrassing how even long, to say it. How long did you actually shoot it? Were you shooting it during we COVID? Shot, End of well, we shot uh, season three and four back to back, so we okay. shot for two years during COVID. Wow. Yeah, so we was were, it hard to we stay, were... like, you know, fighting for him when all that sourdough bread was waiting back home? Oh, I thought you were calling me sourdough bread. I was like, ooh, that, that hurt my feelings. That'd be a good stripper name. <laughs> mm -hmm. The yeast is rising. Yeah, oh, okay. We have a, a clip here. Do you want to do... Is it going to be obvious what's happening here? It's, uh, there's, I think of all the clips I've ever shown on a talk show, this is the most obvious clip ever. Jim, let's find out if he's right. <laughs> this is Tango, 3-6. Requesting to land and drop off one pack. Inbound helicopter, this is U.S. Navy warship 8-0. You are not clear to land. I say again, you are not clear to land. Turn outbound immediately. Sorry, amigos. They said no go. Dr. Ryan! How bad you need to get on that ship? Life or death? Have a nice Classic Jack Ryan. Classic Jack Ryan. Build the ocean, get him his watch. Now, here's the thing. That really looks like you fell out of that helicopter. That is me not being... That, that's me being thrown out of a helicopter. So what happened was that morning, they had done that stunt with the stunt team over and over and over. And they were flying me out in a Blackhawk to get to the middle of the ocean, slowly drop me down in the water, and then just do the shot of the helicopter pulling away. 
And as we're going, one of my favorite parts about doing the show is to interact with the military community. And we were in uh, Black Hawk with all SEALs. And that gentleman right there is Kevin Kent. He's a wonderful guy, and I've done four seasons with him. Yeah, this guy. Which is now, now you just labeled him as this guy. He's so much more than that. <laughs> but as we were flying, he said, um, are you going to do this stunt? And I was like, no, they shot it this morning. And he was like, yeah, it would look a lot cooler if you did it. And I was like, yeah, we didn't plan for that, so I don't even know what that would look like. He goes, it would look like me grabbing the seatbelt, unbuckling you, and throwing you out of this helicopter. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to do that. And the camera guy was sitting there like this, like, please don't do this. They hadn't told any of the producers or anything. And I went, all right, let's do it. And the camera guy jumps up. He unbuckled me and threw me out of the Blackhawk. And the camera guy got it. Yeah. And got this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was great. Hey, we have to take uh, uh, another little break here. Do we? We do. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back. I don't know what we're going to get out of here. We'll be.